Is Cooper Flag the future of the NBA? As we all know, NBA drafting is a difficult task. It requires not only physical strength, but also intelligence. However, Cooper Flag seems to have both of these qualities in abundance. But does he have the potential to be the next superstar of the NBA? In this video, we'll take an in-depth look at one of the most exciting young prospects in the basketball world today, Cooper Flag. You'll know why Cooper Flag is going to be the next big thing in basketball after watching this whole video. Cooper Flag was born in Newport, Maine on December 21, 2006. His mom and dad's names are Kelly and Eric Flag. Both his parents were collegiate athletes. His mom played basketball at the University of Maine and his dad played baseball at the University of New Hampshire. You could say that his parents are the source of his athleticism. Early in life, Flag started playing hoops. He went to Newport, Maine's Nakamas Regional High School and started on the varsity team all four years. He averaged 20.5 points, 10 rebounds, 6.2 assists, 3.7 steals, and 3.7 blocks per game as a rookie and was named the main Gatorade Player of the Year. Nakamas won the Class A state title with his help. When Flag was a freshman, he moved to Florida and started at Montverde Academy there. It's widely known that Montverde has one of the best high school basketball teams in the country. As a sophomore at Montverde, Flag continues to excel, averaging 16 points, 7 rebounds, 4 assists, and 2 steals per game. Nominated for the Naismith Prep Player of the Year award and named the tournament's most valuable player. Impressive, right? At present, Flag is just 16 years old and already making waves in the basketball world. He's a five-star recruit and the second-ranked player in the class of 2025. Even though he's only a sophomore, big-name schools like Duke, UConn, Michigan, Villanova, and UCLA are already after him. Cooper took on the best of the best when he joined the Elite Youth Basketball League, EYBL. And let me tell you, he didn't just hold his own, he dominated. In his very first EYBL game, he dropped a massive 52 points, grabbed 12 rebounds, and shot an incredible 16 of 18 from the field. That performance set a new record for the highest scoring game in EYBL history. And guess what? He didn't stop there. He kept doing it again and again. There was this one game where he scored 22 points, grabbed 17 rebounds, and blocked 5 shots. And his team won against Tyler Hero Squad. Then he had another game where he put up 21 points, snagged 10 rebounds, and dished out 7 assists. And guess who he was up against? Cameron Boozer, son of former NBA All-Star Carlos Boozer, who's giving Cooper a run for his money in their class. Talk about some tough competition. Cooper also had this insane game during Peach Jam where he dropped 38 points, pulled down 16 rebounds, dished out 6 assists, and blocked 11 shots. And get this, he had the game-winning block. That is clutch. Honestly, we've never seen anything like this before. Even though his team lost in the championship game, Cooper still put up 18 points, 12 rebounds, and 7 assists. Those games, in my humble opinion, set him apart from everyone else in his class. His shooting skills, that lightning quick first step, his natural athleticism combined with his basketball IQ, and his ability to make plays on the wing, it's all next level. Plus, his defense is just bonkers. With those crazy long arms of his, he's like a shot blocking machine, making opponents second guess every move they make. It's like watching a basketball wizard in action. Also, basketball legends are all pretty pumped about this young gun's potential. According to LeBron James, this guy is something truly special. He's got it all, the size, the length, the athleticism, and the skills. It's like he's the complete package. Stephen Curry, on the other hand, believes this player is a jack-of-all-trades. He can score, rebound, pass, and even defend. Curry's convinced he's on track to become a standout player in the NBA. Kevin Durant, not one to mince words, describes him as a unicorn. Not the mythical creature, but a once-in-a-generation kind of talent. Durant firmly believes this rising star is destined to become a bona fide superstar. Cooper Flag's way of playing defense is good. He blocks shots by jumping straight up and using his arms well while staying out of foul trouble. It's clear that he takes time when he's moving through screens or blocking attacks. But Cooper really stands out because of his ability to follow the ball. He goes from being a health defender to blocking shots without any problems. 
He's very good at figuring out what ball players are trying to do and stopping shots with his speed. He can block shots even when he's in a post-up position. He can read spin moves and block tries. Cooper is also very good at guarding the shake man in corners during ball screens or runs, which shows how disciplined and versatile he is. In addition to these skills, Cooper Flag can stop reverse layups, which is not something that many prospects can do. Some offensive players use backward layups to get around shot blockers, but he's too competitive for that. Also, recently Flag drew a lot of attention on the first day of Curry camp. Even Stephen Curry was impressed by his skills. Curry was seen dominating young players in short clips, but Cooper's performance jumped out. There are videos of Cooper's amazing skills going around on Instagram, but seeing him play against a famous player like Steph Curry in real life was the best way to see how good he really is. The other player's actions and reactions on the floor also showed how good Cooper's game was, especially when we compared it to some of the other players. Even though Curry got a lot of attention and the camp had high hopes, Cooper Flagg's exceptional skills made an unforgettable impression. Now, here's an interesting story. There was a bit of buzz going around that Bradley Beal got into it with a young NBA prospect named Cooper Flagg during a one-on-one -on -one game at Jason Tatum's elite camp. Brian Scalabrine spilled the beans, claiming that Flagg was trash-talking Beal and things got heated. But then, Beal hopped on Instagram and responded with a confused, huh? Followed by some laughing and cap emojis. Basically, he was saying, nah, that ain't true. Fast forward a week, and Flagg said the whole thing was fake news. According to him, there was no one-on-one -on -one showdown with Beal, and they're cool. So, it looks like there was some drama, but maybe not as much as we thought. Many experts are comparing Cooper Flagg to NBA legends like Scottie Pippen, Andre Kirilenko, and Kevin Durant due to his impressive combination of size, athleticism, and versatile skills. Like Pippen, Flagg has similar ability to excel in defense, passing, and rebounding, making him a valuable all-around player. Much like Kirilenko, Flagg's 6'9 frame and athleticism enable him to contribute on both ends of the court excelling in defense and rebounding while showing promise as a versatile scorer. Moreover, Flag shares similarities with Kevin Durant, as they both possess similar size and scoring prowess. Flag's ability to shoot the ball, coupled with his scoring potential, suggests he could develop into a dominant scorer in the NBA. Reminiscent of Durant's scoring excellence. According to ESPN draft analyst, he thinks Flag could become a truly exceptional talent, Giveney even goes as far as to call him the most well-rounded player among the high school class of 2025. He also drew comparisons to LeBron James, pointing out that Flag shares similarities in terms of size, athleticism, and passing skills. Another NBA draft expert shared his thoughts on Flag, describing him as a one-of-a-kind talent. Schmitz believes that Flag has the potential to consistently deliver triple doubles in the future. Schmitz also made an interesting comparison likening Flagg to Larry Bird, highlighting his shooting ability and knack for making great passes. Honestly, he's a player like we've never seen before because he's so talented, doesn't fear anything, never gives up. Don't forget that he's only 16 years old. He just learned how to drive a car. Just think about how excited NBA teams are about the chance to pick him. There will likely be a tanking in the next couple of years as teams try to get him. But here's the big question. Can he keep up with this extraordinary performance in college and beyond? The NBA loves versatile players, especially those who can do it all on the court, and he fits that bill perfectly. I have no doubt in my mind that he's going to be a top pick in the 2025 draft. Already, he's got NBA players and legends offering him guidance and support. He's going to keep evolving, adding new dimensions to his game. So, when it comes to talk about who might be this generation's greatest player, well, it's quite possible that this kid right here could be the one we're all talking about in the future. What are your thoughts on Cooper Flagg's prospects? Do you agree with the comparisons to NBA legends? Or do you have other players in mind for his potential trajectory?